But what I've decided I want to do is anytime I walk out this door here, I want to have a clear day. Actually, what I just found out is these clear shells are for just clear weather and not a clear day. And what I built here also had yeah these weather change shells are clear weather and I just fired one off this is what it looks like this is nice though and but what I did is I used yeah I jumped over it I wish this dude would I'd just I'd like to trade some items oh no oh god help me anyway I have the wrong switch here. Let me show you what I mean. This here is a laser tripwire. Well, you, you son of a bitch. This here is a laser tripwire. And, um, I forget. Well, it doesn't give me the uh, explanation. Okay, there's two of them. There's one that transmits power, toggles power. And then there's one that transmits power. The difference being, as long as this. A line is broken it transmits power otherwise it toggles it you break the beam and it turns it on com completely until you break the beam again and then it turns it off those are the two differences so I'm going to save that one and I've got to do something with this fool can we trade a few things and it keeps telling me to trade I'm about to lose it man I want to move him you know what I wonder, I almost attempted just to disable him. Let me uh, go ahead and get this over with. So, the switch I'm looking for is under conveyors, meant for conveyor belts, really. But it gives us two additional options we didn't have before transmits power while triggered. That's what I want. Because I'm just going to walk through it. There we go. Let's try this sucker out right here. I got me that little piece right there hooked up to the pipe. It was a nice little conduit piece that they provided us. They provided us a whole bunch of conduit pieces. And then um, from here, we're going to fire off the shell. Let's give it a try. I just wanted to fire one shell. And I'm successful. One shell only. One pin mortar saw. Let me try a different thing here. Let me try, uh, let's change the weather back to rainy weather. I think they provide a rainy weather shell. Transmits power while triggered as opposed to transmits power on and off when triggered. No, we don't want that. I'm using one of those somewhere else. Let's put that right there. Let's put that right there. And let's come over here and find us a mortar. I mean a uh, fireworks mortar. Angled. Uh oh. That one decided to start firing off for some reason. Oh, because of that idiot walked through my, my trip wire. Man, that's it. I'm going to move him right now. That's enough. You're out of here. I'm going to exile him to the worst place I can think of. Outpost Zimonja. See ya. Asshole. Alright, so now I need... See, it made me forget what I was doing. Alright, so now I need me some shells. So let's run over here. Oh wow, I don't have a uh, 
That's right. I, I, I destroyed everything out here. Okay, so let me build me a quick factory. We're going to lose that stuff right there. We're going to build a quick factory here to build this stuff. I'm going to show you what I do when I just want to build a quick item. Uh, well, as quick as quick as I I am, which ain't very quick. You know these builders and mills don't snap in. You know here's Fallout again making things that they're they're firing off my shells. That dude is still over there jacking around. Look at that. He just wasted out about 14 of my shell. You know I. I cheat a little bit, but I don't. I haven't cheated too much with materials. I got a box of materials that I've used for testing only. I filled it up with a thousand of every scrap item that I've just used for using this stuff here. But all my work at workshop items, I've tried to uh, keep separate, to keep the integrity of the uh, immersiveness of the survival mode. Okay, let's do that right there and he needs power now something else that I've learned on these is once you've powered up a conveyor you can run it from there in on out and everything connected to that conveyor will be powered that whole factory that I had built earlier was all powered off of one powered conveyor and that's a that's a, a an item that they provide the powered conveyor belt and I believe the use for that is uh, and it's the one with the picture at the beginning of the uh, menu you know they got one with no legs this one power junction and this one this one will power up your whole conveyor system okay and I just to quickly make something since I'm not uh, I don't have a functioning factory yet let's run over here and see what it takes I kind of know but I'm gonna look anyway I will make sure my thing is there too. make sure my uh, pyrotechnics mill shows up and also you have to select what you want to use or what you want to build it won't build anything until you uh, tell it to build something. I'm going to tell it to build the rain shells. And then it... Oh, okay, so it does require something a little bit different here. Instead of gold for the uh, clear day, this one requires silver in lieu of the gold. Okay, adhesive cloth fertilizer silver. You know, this game also teaches you your memory skills, which I have very little, very little memory capabilities. Fertilizer, so it helps me. Okay, I'm over here. And what I want is some fertilizer, adhesive. And like I said, I gave myself these items, so I'm cheating right now. I want to give me 50 fertilizer cloth silver well I'm rich I got all that silver man looky there I cheated and see what I've done is I've done forgot what the other one was oh my god it's just too much smoking too much, too much, too much. Adhesive cloth, fertilizer, and silver. Had it. I had it all along. 
Black Death. Now I could load up this component sorter with one adhesive, one fertilizer, one cloth, and one silver, and then dump it over here and it would pull it out and, and then stick it in here. You know, by the inventory, I'm talking about that right there. This is a component sorter. Now as you'll notice, I can put an adhesive in there. Right? And I can put a cloth. Because these are raw scrap items, base items. Because it's a component sorter, it's going to sort out those items. But will it, what it won't let me put in there is anything else. See? Nothing. But I'm going to put everything in here just to speed things up. Adhesive, cloth, fertilizer, and gold. That's what I didn't have. See, I'm learning. My memory's improved by one fertilizer today. I'm lying. Black Death is a hell of a robot. There we go. All right. Now there's another little thing about these conveyors. Some of them won't dump the stuff off. I had one that didn't dump it off. And what happened is it showed up in my inventory. But I don't know if that was a mistake. That was the frag grenades. Oh wow, I got a bug. I keep walking backwards, look at that. Isn't that weird? That's a bug in the system. I won't stop walking backwards. Let's see if that little exercise will help it out. No. Man alive, can you believe that? Now how in the hell am I going to do? Man. Alright, I'm bugged out here. Alright, I'm going to cut the video short and restart the game because... You got the gist of it. I'm going to hook that up with a rainy day. So when I walk through this door, it's going to rain. When I walk the other one, it's clear day. As long as there's not settlers in there jacking things up. I guess that's the that's the uh, kink in the system there. That's the canary in the coal mine. Oh, I stopped walking backwards. And again, the only way I really find my shells is I go to Mish and hit Z twice to sort by weight and put them up at the top. There we go. Let me just fire another one off for fun. <laughs> it looks like it's hitting this thing. Now I wonder if that's not, it's not raining. I wonder if that's because it hit that Conduit that up. Uh, oh, golly. Try it again. I'm glad I saved one. Alright, so we learned a couple of things today. We learned fertilizer. And the shells got to fire off into the air. They can't hit something. So no fire and mortars inside. Alright, appreciate you.